Welcome. Uh, we're sitting here. I uh, want to talk about a little bit what uh, OTV does for Cisco's data center interconnect solution, and in particular in the context of long distance free motion. Uh, let me introduce uh, Max Adika. He's uh, the architect for data center interconnect in Cisco. And myself, I'm Thomas Scheibe. Uh, I'm responsible for data center architectures in Cisco. Uh, Max, so maybe you, know, you can go a little bit over what OTV actually does and why this is actually great uh, new technology that we brought out uh, for Data Center Interconnect. Sure. Uh, well, the first thing I would say is that, as the name st uh, says, uh, OTV stands for Overlay Transport Virtualization. And it's really an overlay technology that can be used to deploy LAN extension mm -hmm. communication between sites. So being an overlay technology brings essentially two main advantages. One side, it can be deployed across different type of connectivity between uh, data center sites. So you may have uh, scenarios where customers have dark fiber or an MPLS type of cloud connectivity or an IP core, mm -hmm. and o o OTV can be seamlessly deployed across all these different mm. uh, deployment options. Yeah. The other angle is being, again, an overlay, allows you essentially to be deployed without really modifying the design principle the customer traditionally use to deploy data center network. And for example, the most important thing is that it allows you to uh, extend land connectivity without modifying, for example, the boundary between layer two and layer three in the network. So you can maintain that functionality, the aggregation. So basically, you maintain the network configured as is by following the best practice, and you overlay this technology on top to, yeah. to do more. That sounds great because I think one of the things that customers are always looking at when we come up with new technology, do I have to change product? The answer here, what I hear, is actually it's a very nice addition. We can introduce this by adding in the aggregation layer OTV without touching your core, without touching your access. That's uh, correct. Yeah. Maybe let me ask another question. One of the other points we have, most data centers today interconnect as two sites. I think OTV is playing in this direction. It gives you way more flexibility with respect to scale. OTV provides uh, by nature a multi-point type of connectivity, so you can connect very easily multiple sites. Uh, you can add and remove connectivity to sites without, uh, in a kind of in a seamless fashion, yeah. and being so easy to basically uh, configure and deploy allows you also to, for, uh, to extend this LAN extension both inside the data center or between sites very seamlessly. Okay, and so easy, easy yeah. to configure and deploy. I mean, I would have thought whenever we bring out technology, it's a lot of configuration. Is that mm -hmm. is that not the case with OTV? Did I hear that correctly? This is actually one of the silver bullets of OTV is that it does a lot of functionality under the hood, but from a configuration and operational point of view, really the customer has to enter three, four line of, com of configuration and, the, and everything is done and the design is done. Wow, that sounds fantastic. Max, appreciate the insight in OTV. Absolutely. And we're looking forward to having actually a lot of deployments with OTV in the data center interconnect space. Uh, thanks for your attention.